Hi friends, this is Mohammed Shakil here and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can design a knuckle join in KTV5. So in this whole tutorial we're going to use the part design, assembly design and wireframe and surface design workbench. On the right side you can see the completed uh, assembled part of the knuckle join and on the left side you can see the different drawings which are required to do the design. So uh, the special thing about this particular uh, drawing is that the drawing is giving an ice isometric view. So if you're going to use only this drawing to do the complete design. So you can see it's a pretty easy uh, uh, you know, assembly over here. You can see the collar and pin and uh, eye end of the road and the fork end of the road over here and here. So <clears throat> let's just uh, start off creating the different parts. So to start off let me just uh, start with the pin which you can see here. So I'll just open up a new file, the part design. and I'll name it as pin hyphen knuckle joint alright I'll click on OK and you get the new workbench here or the new drawing file and what you need to do is you're gonna create this particular diameter so that's gonna be 40 diameter diameter of 40. I'll just come out and I'll give a thickness of 12. Alright, now I'll select this face and I'll again give one more circular sketch. And that must be of diameter uh, 25. Come out of the sketch and again do a padding of 84 alright we got the pin and we need to make a small hole over here so we're gonna leave that uh, we're not gonna do that now we'll do that uh, once we do the complete assembly we can actually do that using uh, projection uh, that I'm gonna discuss uh, in the coming tutorial so this is actually sufficient for the pin and uh, let's look ahead and find out what else is to be done so for now you can just create a plane at a distance of uh, 12, reverse direction, 12. So let there be a plane and we'll uh, think about it later. So just go for save and save it uh, at any of the place you want. Um, and just make sure that w you're putting all these parts in one particular folder so that it's easy for you and you don't get confused. And that's all for uh, this particular part of the tutorial. Keep watching to complete the uh, complete design of the knuckle joint which you can see over here. Thank you so much for watching and if you have any doubts, clarifications, you can always write to me at ketia.pro.user at gmail.com or else you can comment on my video. And that's it. Stay tuned.